I think a lot of people are searching for answers. I think the perils and the challenges we face are unprecedented. There is a need for Catholics to step forward. There's an opportunity for us to become saints. Life is an adventure, and we are called to a heroic life. We are called to achieve great things. I want to be the best human being I can possibly be on this earth. At Magdalen College, our motto is Duke and Alton. Go out into the deep. And it is a calling to go out into uncharted waters and into places we've never gone before. Magdalen College is a Catholic liberal arts college in Warner, New Hampshire. It's unlike any other program in the country. And one of the main tasks we have here is to constantly bring students back to the fundamental questions. Who am I? What does it mean to be a human person? Here, we've got more than 2,000 years of stories. We pay attention. We sit at the feet of these people who tell us the stories because they're wise. One of the main basis of this education is dialogue. Over the course of the year, you see students developing as debaters, as thinkers. The change in maturity is quite evident. The program does a really excellent job here of really integrating you fully into the community. Everything from hiking to playing soccer, to singing in the choir on, on Sundays. The Catholic faith animates our community. In some ways, it's the sun that shines over our entire enterprise. But the faith is a living thing, and it's a, a kind of current that draws students toward Christ. Every aspect of yourself will be spoken to. The spiritual part of yourself, the intellectual part of yourself. The capacity for friendships and relationships and community, you will experience them to a depth that you've probably never experienced before. We're on a mountain. It's a place that represents liberal education. It's a place where you get a view of the whole from the top. One day you climb that mountain and suddenly you see all that you thought you knew from a completely different perspective. And it's going to affect how we see the rest of our lives, how we understand reality. But you can't stay on top of the mountain. At some point, you have to come back down and re-enter the world. It's true that we educate students for their first job out of college, but we are educating them for much more, for what they are going to do 10, 20 years later. When they are leading institutions, when they are bishops, judges, CEOs, and heads of nonprofits, are they going to have the wisdom that they need to make the decisions to direct the course of these institutions to shape our society? That's what this education is for. The world needs strong individuals who are confident in themselves, who are able to express themselves, who know how to stand up for their beliefs and for what is right. That's what the whole program of studies here really does. We like to tell our students that we want them to be able to navigate a text by Thomas Aquinas as well as the New York subway. We want them to have the theoretical knowledge and wisdom as well as the skills and the courage to go out into the world to do whatever it is that God has called them to do. We don't live for ourselves. We live for God and we live for His church and we live for the needs of the world. But here together in this community, it can be achieved and that kind of greatness is open to all of us.